little addendum to the previous video as I was uh, walking out, um, still up in the, the quarry, but noticed right here, Eddie's noticing it too, um, you know, hole, looks like something driven down into this, some sort of stake, and another larger one over here, so I'm, I'm curious to see, because it kind of would make sense that that would be a broken, <laughs> a broken, um, you know, if we look, if we think of those, those marks, you know, they kind of hole, 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 and then they break up and you have a half circle. So maybe that's part of the, the strategy. I really, I don't know. I don't I see, I see one over here. I don't really know much about that. So it's something that would be worth learning. Yeah, right here. Check it out. See, like half circle at the top. So if we thought of, you know, the other piece of this that broke off, that would, that would have the other circle on there. So driving down into it, I mean, I, I don't think they were using TNT or dy dynamite until late 1800s. So like 1870s, maybe I'm not, I'm not exactly sure um, on the year on that, but I don't know. That'd be interesting to figure out how exactly they pulled this off because they definitely didn't have modern technology and machinery uh, to do it. So something else, another piece of the puzzle coming together. All right. I hope that makes sense how I described it. Here's another one here. You can see kind of a busted off piece. They all seem to be about the same length, even the ones we have behind the high school. So that's something I think would be cool for us to to dig into a little bit and connect the history. Yeah, there's more here. So yeah, these would have been stones that, you know, um, obviously they were never used. Uh, maybe they weren't desirable. Maybe they were quarried and then just we kind of moved on from do, using these kind of resources. I don't know. It'd be interesting to learn more about it. Little piece of our past. All right. Have a good day.